Monday, March 29th, 2021. Our driveway is fully in. Um, I think I have another little video showing what's underneath this, but um, I ran into memory on my phone. But anyway, so this is six inches of asphalt millings and then about a foot of river run gravel. Um, the topsoil was dug out. See on the left there, and we also put it on the right and kind of made this ditch smaller. You can see the water actually kind of eroded inside of there. That's got to get cleaned up at some point, but not my biggest concern right now. Anyway, so this was 24 loads of millings and I believe 20 loads of river rock um, for this driveway. And just the driveway, not even like the parking areas and whatnot. So and then we rolled it. It's really nice. You can see the trucks kind of make ruts, but it'll get compacted more. Fabric underneath everything. So eventually, we'll uh, clean that up there. Maybe get some more millings to put on there. So, this weekend I rented a brush mower and went through the woods again. So, you know, you can see in here now. I mean, you won't be able to see in here in a couple of weeks. Like, everything's starting to kind of bloom a little bit. So, I'm probably going to get a wood chipper next weekend and try to chip all the branches in here. And then come back through again with another brush hog. I got to do something with this. The, all the water that ran down this swale right here went in, went through the backhoe tracks and into the water tank. So there's water in there now. Me being stupid. Alright, we'll go up a little further. So here's the park. I brush hogged way down. So this was all brush this way. So I brush hogged all the way down to like here. So basically doubled the size of the park, but again, we'll get the chipper in here and we'll get rid of some of this stuff. And then at some point, it'd be really nice. This is where our fire truck turnaround is supposed to be. So maybe we'll, uh, you know, depending on how much money we have left, we'll do this sooner than later and get some, get a nice place to turn around and I have that, it's all muddy and ugh. So it'd be nice to have a nice spot that's a place to park like this, but you know, you can not you can park on here, but you can't drive past it. So anyway, the park's kind of a mess. We gotta get rid of these piles of dirt, but it's, it's been rainy and wet, so we can't really do much right now. So right now, Matt's taking out the stumps. Um, you're really only taking out his, the ones he dug out, which is probably gonna be six loads of them. At, again, $300 a pop. $300 a truckload. So, come up here. We're all clear. We got our... Oh, this is a big pile of mulch. So we're excavating for our foundation. Footer is tomorrow, Tuesday. Pour on the walls probably by the end of the week. So that's our footer depth right there. Have that. So then everything just gets to be that deep right there. <laughs> 